Hi everyone, this is Leslie from Midlife and Nailing It. If you could please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, that would be fantastic. This is actually uh, part two of our first video from our series I'm going to call Our House. Uh, we are in the middle of building a home and uh, for this first month it actually turned out to be information that I really need to make into two videos uh, because it's covering six months. Uh, the rest of the series will only be one video a piece each month uh, because it'll just be updating you on the month that we're in. Thanks so much for watching. Yeah, right. When it starts seeming not okay, especially with real estate, you guys, I don't care if it's a real estate agent, I don't care. There are some great people in the industry, but there are some crooks in the industry. And there are people that are trying to get something for nothing. And you really, if something doesn't feel right in your heart, like, run. Seriously. No. It's no. This is a lot of money we're dealing with. These, This is the work that we've put into a home. Uh, this is our bottom line. It is okay to not, if you don't feel okay about something, I would say don't, don't be trying to make it okay in your head. Like... Right. Uh, I, that's just from life experience, bad and good that I've had in my life. So, I'll just give a little bit of a back history on what, how we came to the decision of building or what it was there. Uh, we started to look at houses in our area that were sort of in the price range that we wanted to go. Uh, for the amount of money we would have spent, we could have a house built. And in the area we wanted to be in. In the area we wanted to be in. Mm -hmm. and for the same price. For, for yeah, the same price. And the, ins the assurance there with that is just to have new things. Just, and that, you know, and just that's just know. about timing, too. That right. just has to do with um, our area, our county that we're in. The market was raising right. so fast that the, uh, the builders, and we're not going with, like, one builder or building it our very own selves. We're going through... A company, a company. Um, and uh, they hadn't caught up with the new trend honestly and so in fact our house isn't built and it's worth it appraised for more than what we're even paying to have it built for just because we just slid right in there guys we were so lucky and we know we were lucky we really really do when when you build it is a you know it's exciting to be able to have a hand in what's really going to be going on in your house how, right how this and that's going to be set up or um yeah we picked out happen. everything like we had a day where we went and they have this huge like warehouse set up with anything and everything you could think of even things you don't even think of when you're going to build a house and we were able to pick everything up and we upgraded some stuff we didn't upgrade some things we whatever and uh, we were happy with the outcome so all of that's going pretty smooth it it does take a while and that can be kind of uh frustrating um we're six months into it um we are in a an, an apartment that is way smaller than what works for our family. I mean, it's Randy and I, we have two teenagers, we have a cat and a dog, and we obviously were not going to get rid of our cat and dog, but my God, you guys, this is like, and, and it's also a community that is not up to our standards. Yeah. And we feel like it's incredibly overpriced for what it actually is, and just it's frustrating. Like, I started this YouTube channel, for example, and the lighting sucks in here. There's no room. My kitchen is small, but I'm trying to make it work until everything's done. We've both also had really good experiences at apartments. It's in, just not this in, one. In apartment living. Yeah. It's not, that's not to say. We could do a whole nother video uh, on just that. This, just, uh, the point is. <laughs> Is that we're in we this, can't wait for our house to be built. We're in this process. <laughs> we're in the and, process. Um, so now we're getting uh, to the point where they're they're going to start building for real building. Um, yeah, all of our permits we, are back. That takes a while. Right, we, and we started a little bit early because we wanted the lot we wanted. Yes. Um, so when we contacted the company, they told us sort of where they were and where we were and that sort of thing as far as And another timeline. tip guys if it's something you want right. and they're like we can meet with you in a few weeks you can say no I can bring my checkbook now who do I write a check to right. because 
we wanted the lot we wanted. We knew the market was going up and we knew they weren't cut, caught up mm -hmm. to that trend. Sure enough, the following month they changed all their pricing. We locked it in. We right. insisted on meeting with them. The, it was like yeah. the last week in July. They were like, we yeah. can meet with you next week. No, meet with us. Squeeze it. Or no deal. Just... Like, you got to get tough, man. These are big dollar amounts. You do. You <laughs> really were, do. And they were really. This is your family. This is your big dollar amounts you're talking about. Like, And they're very kind and awesome. Yeah. Um, but really money talks, us, guys. So. so when I was like, we'll write you a check right now. They were like, come right now. You know, we just didn't want to lose the lots. The lots started selling out like we wanted what we wanted. So. So we just. The timeline, however it worked out between us, uh, was somewhere around a year, uh, and now we're, and, and that was just the way that we, just our situation, the way that we had right. figured it out. So now we're at the point where we're going to go into the, what they call the production stage. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, the last stage they had yeah, a, a so little pamphlet been, in the last I, stage. When I was a kid, they were like, you're gonna be frustrated. The funny thing, when I was a kid, we used to, I used to play this game called The Sims, <laughs> and uh, and now our uh, kids play that game and actually made the new house on that game based on the blueprints that we had brought up and oh everything. yeah Chandler did he and took the blueprints cool. yeah yeah <laughs> and he tried to match all the colors and everything because we actually he did we, we went to the so showcase cute. so uh, excited he I let him miss school to come with us he's so he they're both excited but he yeah. is so freaking excited so we've kind of been playing the sims here in yeah. general coming up with what you know what's the house gonna look like well yep. It's going to be this brown against this red, and it's like... Oh, and it takes them a minute to do the CAD drawing. <laughs> it takes them a minute to pull the permits. And we just got, yeah, this so last week, we got emails that they're about they're breaking ground. Just They've got to, it all Just trying to, visualize, to yeah. visualize things. And somewhere um, in this video, I don't know if at the end or if I'll slide it in during... Um, I'll show you what our old house looked like. And I'll go ahead and um, show you what our lot looks like. So real quick guys, this is a photo of our home right before we put it on the market. I just wanted you guys to be able to visualize the home that we are talking about when we were talking about selling. And then I also wanted to include a photo of what our lot looks like. Uh, yeah, so this is the lot that we purchased that our home will be built on. So we plan on once a month um, getting on here and giving you an update about where we're at with things. So, yeah, so right now they're getting ready to start building and break ground. Um, and that's where we're at. We've got, you know, our, our house sold. We got living arrangements in the meantime. I mean, they're not the best, but we've got them. And um, we secured everything else like finances, um, we picked everything out. They did the CAD drawings. They did all the permits. So now building is yeah. what's happening. Okay, so that's our story so far with our home. And like I said, we're going to do an update each month. Uh, if you have any experiences you want to share or you have any questions, and I mean, we may or may not be able to answer them because once again, we aren't, we're just everyday people we're not yeah. we're not real estate agents we're not builders we're none of those things mm -hmm. um, but if you have any any comments or questions or anything like that please leave them in the comments below and next month when we uh, do our next uh, house update video uh, we will answer them yep. we'll try to answer them the best that we can yep so uh, yep just leave your comments for us below and uh and again, Happy New Year, guys. New we Year's hope everybody. this year is amazing for you and uh, it's a peaceful year for everybody. And uh, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for watching. See you soon.